Right. Got a authentic Gandela's classical guitar made of spruce. I believe it's German spruce and uh, Mexican rosewood. Solid body guitar. Um, ebony fingerboard. Um, I believe this also looks like a rosewood neck. This is from, I believe, uh, 80s. Candela's Guitar Shop is a uh, three or four generation guitar shop in Luthiers out of East Los Angeles. Specializing in folk instruments. Look them up on YouTube and check out the history. This one was made by uh, Candelario uh, Delgado. Um, it says Candela's guitar Delgado Brothers. This is meant for there's no pickup in it. So I think it's made for like mariachi. Um, or like a trio bolero. sun here so to it. 
it's not necessarily classical guitar. Look at the depth, the grain. Uh, very fortunate to have this guitar here. So it's custom made, it's custom ordered. Purchased it from the gentleman that ordered it. He ordered a set. I'm trying to see if you can see the name here. It is. He ordered a set. He put this with this. Uh, what is this called? A, a, a Rosette, I believe. He ordered three. He ordered a Requinto, Romantico. He ordered a Harana, and he ordered this guitar. Like I said, this is from the 80s. Maybe 1984, I believe. So the wood is aged. They make flamenco guitars, vihuelas, guitarrones, but I like to think that they specialize in classical guitar making. I know the brothers also do. One of them's in Nashville. He does a lot of steel string folk instruments. I also have another guitar that Tomas made for me. This guitar was made by Tomas's dad. Tomas is the uh, the owner of the guitar shop now in East LA. What would I use this to? I'd use this to practice. I would use this for a gig. I don't play bolero gigs. Or I'm not part of a mariachi. I'm gonna use this as a songwriting guitar. A guitar like this will inspire me as a guitarist to play. Look at that beautiful grain. Inspire me to write songs, uh, to do, uh, to become a better guitarist. The neck is kind of a, um, I'd say, uh, D-shape, like a D-shaped neck, uh, fits very comfortably in the hand. But this is like a, like a '60s kind of like Stratocaster, or a, I'm not comparing it. I'm just saying it's like vintage, you know, or thick Les Paul, or maybe like the original Telecasters. But uh, I played a lot of many guitars, and I have many guitars different purposes. I have a Godin that's flat, you know, but it doesn't sound like this. Kind of going out of tune because of the sun. There's a great Hugh Hausner uh, documentary on uh, Candela's Guitar Shop in East LA. Look it up on YouTube. It's great. myself don't live too far from there so classical music but I would say this is well made master guitar which this is a master guitar they don't doesn't have to have all the bells and whistles this is a master guitar master instrument one of a kind sounding this room. It's 
right up there with the, you know, Con de Hermanos or the, um, I don't know. I, would, I, I really don't know too much about the older guitars, Torres or. Segovia played, but this is it's not a flamenco guitar. This isn't even really a traditional classical guitar. This is just it's a well-crafted instrument. It's, very, it's got a lot of great low end to it. I have Didario. Dario strings, nylon strings, uh, nor, um, normal tension, but these are the uh, um, these are the higher level strings that I have on here. 